Hi, NT Youth. My name is Aiden Park. I'm a sophomore at Valencia High School, and today's devotional comes from Deuteronomy chapter 5, verses 22 to 33. Um, in this passage, Moses had just finished giving the Israelites the Ten Commandments, which were given from God on two tablets of stone. Um, as it says in verse 22, These words the Lord spoke to all your assembly at the mountain, out of the midst of the fire, the cloud, and the thick darkness, with a loud voice, and he added no more. Uh, this scene really illustrates God's power um, with all the fire and the clouds. And later on in the passage, it goes in depth on God's holiness. At the time, no one was allowed to talk to or approach God um, because no one was holy enough to do so. If anyone tried, then they would die. Um, this power and holiness really struck fear through the Israelites because, well, they didn't want to die. Um, it was even to a point where they told Moses that he should be the one to talk to God and then he should just tell them what God had told him. Um, they really did not want God to talk to them directly because, um, well, they had a fear of God. And this actually pleased God. In verse 28, it says, And the Lord heard your words when you spoke to me. And the Lord said to me, I have heard the words of this people which they have spoken to you. They are right in all that they have spoken. I feel this passage is a really good reminder for us that we should have a fear of God. Not the same way we fear a dictator or maybe our parents after we do bad on a test, but a fear of God with reverence and awe. If we have this type of fear with reverence and awe in our hearts, then I feel we would have a deeper hatred of sin as well as a deeper love of God, and we would have a larger drive to do everything we do in God's name. Thank you guys for your time, and hope you guys have an awesome day.